welcome back in tech learning and in this video i'm going to show you how you can make the car drift system with the sky mask in unreal engine 5.1.1 and yeah i'm going to give you the full project file and the source with vfx and with this texture also so don't forget to like share and subscribe to tech learning and there's a no ads will be in the link so you can directly download and at the last of the video i'll show you that how you need to download the project file too so yeah let's dive in the the first thing this is a request video so thank you so much for the request and here's the basically requester who basically request so thank you so much i mean if you have a request or any comment or you know any solution for us let me know in my comment box or even you have a if you have any custom mechanism request so let me know in my comment box if i have a time i must try to make the video for you okay so thank you so much for coming and let's get start the <laughs> tutorial okay the first thing i'm going to i demonstrate that in unreal engine 5.1 i already created the mechanism so i'll basically going to explain that how i create okay so this is a simple um the third person uh, no it's not the third person this is a vehicle template uh, by default that has come with Unreal Engine 5.1.1. So the first thing I create some VFX. So you find here the tech learning VFX and uh, then go to tech learning textures. There you find some VFX materials, uh, other stuff like the VFX strip that is basically uh, the VFX for uh, the particles. Okay, like the smoke. Okay, so I already created them. So there's a no copyright issue. You can use that in your game. You can sell your own your game. But yeah, don't try to sell my particles because this is verified by Epic. So because I have, you know, I have lots of assets in Epic. So this is also in a including from my Epic asset list. So don't try to upload that in Epic mar Marketplace. But you can use in your game. You can monetize your game. There's a no issue. Okay, so yeah, the second thing is the decal system okay so first what i did is i create a simple vfx which you don't need to create because i'm providing so you need to just go to like, just download this uh, project and just copy paste the content okay but make sure don't try to change the directory directory of this uh, vfx like don't try to move that into like on the other folder so the niagara particles will be never work okay there's an issue in niagara particles that if you move that uh, one place to another place the uh, particle uh, stop working okay so make sure leave it where i say uh, give it name so even if you want to you can give it a try and if, you, and if in your case it's working so there's no issue enjoy but most of cases it's not work so make sure what i give the name and what i did editor do not change anything just use that okay you can do modification because i already had the parameters nodes and everything in colors also you can even control the color if you want more darker or more whiter it's totally depends on you okay and then once you have your particles and you do everything then we need a decal so which and i already created the decals okay this is a kind of like a this is a decal okay yeah it will now see very easily this is a basically the tire decal okay okay or the Skype mask okay skip mask basically so for get my paid course you can visit my udemy account there's a lots of tutorial available also if you want to play my game you can check that on steam app store and google play store also we have now the discord channel so you can join there and do lots of fun and it is more also for get more information for our about video you can check our website also you can get my paid asset and plugins in epic marketplaces link in the description link below the first mechanism what i did in the even begin play okay or even even thick okay i get a sequence node and there i basically get the vehicle movement component and from that i basically verify the speed okay like how much speed i have and if it's more than 2000 uh okay that in my forward speed the float value in more than 2000 so it's been that yeah we are able to drift it's been that our car you can see if i try to uh do from here or the you know or the, if i try to do the hard break it will be never work but if i try to do from in speed so it will be work so that is basically the system basically of the logic so i already set up everything so you don't need to worry even it's work in any type of uh mesh even if you just suppose that you are in this uh, on this one even if you try to do that too it will be work okay oh sorry i have uh, i forget my speed or i just lose my speed but it will be work here too so you don't need to worry 
okay so i tell i just basically verify the drift and that i am able to drift if it's dri uh, if i am able so it's mean that okay we can able to drift and undrift it if, if it's false and then after then uh, i get one more uh, if it's uh you know get it then that is more uh, 1800 then at that time it's mean that we are not able to drift okay that is basically logic uh so from the drift what i'm basically did that from the drift i just get a here a boolean that our uh, drift mode is enable or not and the pressing is basically the uh, space bar or yeah or you can say that break okay so let's give it name that break pressing pre assign it just just fix by your own self okay i just make the mechanism just do this stuff okay so drift then break break press when i press the break and if it's both are true then what will we do it will be add that decal okay so the decal you can if you want you can change the decal whatever if you have some more any other triad decals you can use that from here too i always set up everything so this is for the left tire this is for the right tire okay and once is everything done oh we don't need this stuff and then what i did i add two particles like my vfx uh, particle i just simply drag and drop them at here and i just set or put them at this location okay and i also add two arrow on my tire so what will we do uh, they will be give me the location of oh let me give, make it some more like this okay I need to do some change and adjustable okay yeah so basically this arrow will help you to spawn the decals on the right position so make sure you set up them in the right position and then once you get that the arrow and you need to just attach so it will basically spawn the decal for you in the all the skype mask on a you know in your environment and the second logic is that on in the space bar so on this principle is pressing is meant we are doing the break so if that drift is enabled so at that time it's been okay we have the drift mode enabled and then we are break pressing so then our vfx should be active i mean it's not the break pressing is false and the vfx should be disabled okay so that is the basic the logic of uh the drift system okay so yeah that is the basically pretty uh, uh great logic and a working a working full logic yep so i hope you understand and if you still didn't so let me know in my comment box and now let me show you that where you find basically this project and how you can download so as i say that it will be always work as you can see wherever it doesn't matter but make sure it should be in a ground or something so as you can see it's, it's working great because it's a detail okay now why do you find that you need to just go to my description link and there you may find a website from that website you find my this link that metric learning free project link so this is a repos for this is a public repos so you can go there and simply click on these three dots and at here download the zip with that zip you can find my all of unreal engine folder so you can download that and once you have this uh, download okay and you are you know that how you need to do that like is it's kind of like you to find like that unreal engine zip folder content folder yeah and just enjoy and do all this stuff okay so that's all in this video thanks so much for watching guys see you in the next tutorial video for get my paid course you can visit my udemy account there's lots of tutorial available also if you want to play my game you can check that on steam app store and google play store also we have now the discord channel so you can join there and do lots of fun and it is more also for get more information for our about video you can check our website also, you can get my paid asset and plugins in Epic Marketplaces. Link in the description link below.